Well, Sam Roberts uh, on the pitch after the uh, the game against the friendly against Northampton Saints. I'm just going to come in here and just grab a word with Miles Dorian. Excuse me, lads. Sorry, boys. Um, hello, Miles. That must feel all right. It does feel all right. I got a bit of a knock to the head just at the end there, so I can't really remember most of it, but I saw the scoreboard <laughs> at the end there. It was there. It was yeah, good. Uh, on a bit earlier, I don't know how much news you've got from Jake, but he, he looked injured. Do you, do you know how, how, how injured he was? Not too sure, mate. I'm not too sure if he went straight to the hospital or what, but hopefully... Hopefully he recovers quite well. Was his shoulder? Or, or? Uh, it looked like his arm, but it doesn't matter. But you were on a little bit earlier than, than needs be. But yeah. you must have enjoyed it. I know the conditions were absolutely horrendous. Yeah, not, but not we tight. seemed to score some very good tries. Yeah, out in the backs, we, uh, we tried, tried a few things. They didn't come off, so the forwards pulled through for us. <laughs> So, uh, so as a, as a, as a sh- good team should. <laughs> Excellent. And do you enjoy that? Is that nice getting out? I mean, it's been yeah, a, a few been, few weeks coming, hasn't it? No, it's been a long time, and uh, really, well, we had a good good preseason, and. Uh, it's been well. We've had good fun in our preseason as well. It hasn't just been all all rugby and, and stuff. So we, yeah, it was good to finally get a run out and, and with the, with the new boys that are here and see what they've got. Yeah, it was good fun. Get in there and enjoy a warm bath or Thank an you. ice bath or whatever you they give the you. The rain just stopped. The rain has just stopped. Perfect. <laughs> oh, no. Cheers, Milo. See you later. Uh, Sam Roberts after the game, uh, the friendly with Northampton Saints. I managed to catch a, a word with uh, director of rugby Mike Ray. Um, uh, scoring one to ten. How's that for you? <laughs> Oh yeah, um, yeah. It was about, about a six or seven. Yeah, no, no. Look, it, it's difficult, isn't it? I mean, obviously Northampton had two different sides out there. They were showing their, their England stars, but nevertheless, they got a lot of quality. And uh, please, obviously, not not over the moon, obviously. But there's lots to work on. Um, we looked we looked okay physically against a against a big side, you know, and um, which was which was important for us. Um, we did a lot of work on that side of our game, um, or that side of our preparation, if you like, through the summer, and. You know, we played a bit, you know, which is which, which we like to do. But mm. given the conditions, it became a bit of a lottery, and I think both sides got off mistakes. But um, you know, overall, you know, the b- biggest thing, the pleasing, most pleasing thing, I think, is the three and a half thousand people in here yeah, watching yeah. it. And um, absolutely, you know, long may they continue to come in, and uh, hopefully, if, if we can keep producing performances like that, um, you know, they will come back. They braved it in the rain, and they were rewarded with some. I think Blue scored some. Well, certainly the best tries of the night. Yeah, we did. We did, and um, you know. Uh, and also, we, we actually executed, you know, a couple of times beyond three phases, and, and, and but for a drop pass, um, we might have scored probably the try of the season so far. Mm-hmm. <laughs> I think it was a little inside ball that went down yeah. um, after a good couple of phases. But you know, there was, there was, a, there was some, some some good individual performances, very good individual performances. But also, and we haven't done a lot of organisation, believe it or not. It was pleasing to see that we were we were fairly well organised at times, and, and that's. It's great for us as coaching staff because we haven't done a lot. As I said, we've concentrated more on the, the um, other aspects of, uh, of the game. Um, you know, strength and power, really. And, you know, they came through. But it's also pleasing to, to, to see that um, the organisation from last year's squad sort of kicked in, really. And, 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 that, and that's where we thought we'd like, or we'd hoped to, would be the starting point. And, and, and there were signs that that was tonight. But it, look, it is, it is just a starting point, And that's, you know... Tonight was uh, a little bit of about this big Saracens contingent that we've been uh, sort of uh, given on dual re- registration. Uh, from where I was sitting, I thought they, they equipped themselves really quite well. Oh, I thought they were, they were excellent and um, they, they really slotted in. It looked like they've been training with us all, all pre-season. Um, obviously, clearly they, they haven't, but it's given them a great great opportunity to get, get time in a saddle. And um, you know, obviously, once the hectic schedule of... Uh, of our pre-season and, uh, and their pre-season is out the way we should see them a bit more um, but, but there's pleasing signs there aren't they they're, they're, they're a talented group they're, 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 a, they're a good group of boys they, they mix well and um, they got a bit of rapport obviously travelling together up to training every week um, you know and, and they've slotted seamlessly into changing rooms so ticks in all the boxes for that uh, doesn't not much rest Tuesday night another, another big test for us um, how much do you do in between then and now? Well, very little. So the plan this week was to, to really concentrate on, on the rugby side of things. Mm-hmm. Um, you know, concentrate and, and, and work on our set piece in the games um, and, and, and our work in the tackle area. Uh, and our defence, obviously, against two top sides. Um, you know, uh, that's one out the way. Oh, we, you know, Jake Sharp's a bit of a pity. He's at a hospital for, for an action on his elbow, which is a bit of a pity. But apart from that, we, we've come through relatively unscathed. So that's the bit we, we, we're more concerned about, is it, picking up any more injuries. And hopefully, obviously, Phil Bolton should be right for Tuesday as well. So, Well, good luck. Enjoy tonight. Thanks very much. Cheers, Sam.